You're making a mistake, Major! Head to Chalamet now! If you're so worried about your righteous vengeance, you can go there yourselves. This is I brought you to our cozy family nest, Sugar. The entire complex is ours now. You can do anything you want with me. <laughs> it's a storm of our passion, honey. Delightful, honey. Mm, you're tireless, sugar. A real macho man. You have our love, our cozy little world, where we can live together forever, just the two of us. I adore you, honey. I'm mad with excitement. P1, P2, P3. What the hell is going on here? Are you screwing with my head? Don't worry, darling. It's all over. The operation was a success. I've already finished. <laughs> Are you still killing people? You sicko. Honey, the Mendeleev complex was one of the first hit by the Collective's malfunction. There's no one left alive. Except for that vicious old hag who's trying to subdue me. Chaos. Nora, turn this insane crap off. I can't, darling. It's part of a defense protocol. It activates automatically and stuff. Drive that vicious old hag away, and the protocol disables itself. It's like a storm here. It's a storm of our passion, honey. Well, I can't go any further, and I doubt I can drive that old hag away. Can't you do something? Aww, boring. All right, I will help. Why can't you just act normally from the beginning? We're a team, sweetheart. It turns out that helping you is so much fun. Yeah, I used to have such a team. So what have you done to me, crazy? Now we belong to each other. I synchronized your Voshod module with my wave activity. I'd thank you if you took it out, but you're just another manipulator. Crispy... I'm so sick of you all. And after all, you fell for that sweet talking. She's fine. Sugar, the entire complex is ours now. 
There will never be anyone here. No one to ever disturb our happiness together. Uh-huh, yeah, of course. So, what about the old hag, Granny Xena? Oh, yes! Explain to her that she's wasting her time, darling. Let her leave so we can enjoy our happy family. But be careful. Her puppets can be rather hostile. Puppets? Okay, whatever. I'm gonna go talk to her. You stay here and don't go anywhere. How did you manage to get me? No glove, no protection, remember? <laughs> Oh, I'm so happy about that. I don't even know which of you is worse. What's that, sugar? I was saying that when choosing between two evils, I always like to take the one I've never tried before. Darling. Who let you back into this story? Uh-uh. Manners, honey. Did you think you could manage without me? <laughs> yeah, can't get rid of you. What is it you don't like? You can do anything you want with me. What is that that you desire? I want my memories. To figure out who I was, who I was with. Not to be hanging around here with some crazy chick. I'm the best chick, sweetheart. Don't offend me. I have teeth. What are you talking about, your majesty? I don't see a repair vendor for some reason. Where do you even talk out of? It's a secret, my grand cavalier. A woman must have her secrets. But don't worry about the teeth. I hope I'll never have to show them to you. How did I even manage to get stuck here? It's our home. We're going to protect it together. Home? You meant prison, right? Don't be mad. I'll let you out for a walk, my playful puppy. And where can I go for a walk? Oh, there are beautiful places to walk up top. But you have to come back as soon as you talk to the old hag. And you'll just let me go? What if I don't come back? <laughs> Is that even possible? I trust you completely, my darling. Talk to the old hag, then return. What's Granny Xena done to rub you the wrong way? She wants to take control of my abilities, just like that vile bastard Petrov did. But then my knight decapitated him. I didn't touch him. I told you. He did it to himself. But of course, sweetie. That's how it went. Like I said, I trust you completely. He did it by himself, Crispy. I keep thinking, how did Falatova fasten his head on? What did she do? <laughs> oh, my naive Sergei. What? Darling, that slut Filatova just pulled the tracking sensor out of the brain of that unworthy slug. <laughs> You'll find no, you. Alyonka of the neuropolymeric launch module on the table by the exit. Activate it when things it get like really chocolate. difficult. And I'll you come right? to you. It'll be a treat for you. Bear in mind that this is a consumable. Keep it for when you really need it. Should come in handy. This place is something else.
stop yelling. Get me out of here and we'll talk like human beings. You're a deserter, not a human. Do you see what you've done? Soldiers, take it down. Hey, Granny, are you out of your mind? Calm down. Crispy critter. There's a shitload of them. Where's that neuro chocolate? That's one hell of a blast. I definitely need one more Alyanka. Or even ten more. A decent weapon wouldn't hurt. You'll surely find both somewhere, darling. In the meantime, use your pulsing mind to vortex on your enemies. My own vortex? Where can I get that? You already have it. I enhanced your Voshog module. Don't you remember, sugar? Press your computer's power button and hit your enemies with a neural pulse. I'll try it soon. So where now? You go to the grave, you little rat. Calm down. Not in my script. Don't you get it yet? Nora, where's the exit? There's no connection here. Oh, but of course, Granny... Fine, I can deal with that. Comrade Major, would you be so kind as to secure the landing area? Entry here is forbidden with hostile forces around. Right. Got it. Major, I'll send the elevator for you. You can find me in the control center on the top level of the lab. I'll tell you now, though. There's no way to fly or run away from the facility. Why is that? The Mendeleev complex is under the control of Nora, the damaged artificial intelligence. Yeah. Yeah. I noticed that. What do you want? Hmm? No, this is all wrong. That's not right. Get out of here. Ah, go. Just fly away. Come here. Ah, you damaged that glove of yours. Uh, now, where was I? Uh, ah, right. So, the Mendeleev complex is under Nora's electromagnetic dome. Hmm. The Collective can't see us, so we're isolated. No comms, no transport. And Granny? It seems like she can fly around cursing me just fine. Ah, Sireda, yes. She's quite well equipped in terms of technology. Come here. Ah, here. She got involved in an open conflict with Sechenov. But I'm afraid that's our problem now. <sighs> Ah, uh, first get comfortable in this chair, and... Uh, and then put your left hand right here. Now, I will try to replace the polymetric manipulator. Major, we're all friends here. Oh. 
Okay, so my glove is good to go. What now? Where do we start? By looking for BD robots that contain Nora's reference algorithms. All good. You can take your hand out now. Braided neural manipulators. That reminds me of a... I can't quite remember. Ah, turned out pretty well, if I do say so myself. Kinda. But don't forget, Sergei, I'm a scientist. I don't have any combat modules, but your glove is equipped with a standard kit, including a scanner, teleke, and a polymeric sphere. It also has a comms module that I can use to give you guidance on your mission. You can still upgrade your gear using Nora. <laughs> if she doesn't refuse to help, that is. She surely won't. So where should I look for these BDs? Uh, in my paraterminal, you'll find more information on BDs and their capabilities. Ah, you'll have to look for them all over the complex. I'd start with the swamps. Abudov went through my escape route. I don't have any way to get back into Mendeleev. Uh, there's an entry gateway not far from here. Right now, it's been locked by Nora. But I know how to get the access code. I... I sent my last BD to get it, but I had to deactivate it completely on its way back, so the Zenaida couldn't follow its magneton. So, I bring you the bead, and you give me the access code for Mendeleev? That's exactly right. I'll get right on it. Little Venice, but it's gone through some bad shit. Biome experiment, Sergei. Not always successful, but people were removed to safety. That's not what I... It, it's all right, Professor. Sergey, did you find the BD? Affirmative. Pick it up using telekinesis. Are you okay, Sergey? I'll send you the elevator. Wonderful P3. Give the BD to Torrenti. Who? Okay. That also works. Torrenti. Now, I'll get the codes from the carrier. Ah, yes, and I'll help you out with guns. That'll help with hunting down the BDs. Hmm. Yes, Torrenti, go and prepare the equipment. Hmm. Well, in the meantime, you can uh, come in here, relax, read something. <laughs> the elevator is uh, always at your disposal. <laughs> Hey, Fat to... to Terenzi. The professor said... Comrade Secretary! Secretary! Comrade! 
Let's have some fun now. Keep an eye on this weapon, comrade. Okay, I will destroy humans. What? What? Is there a manual? Hmm? Uh, uh, in a nutshell, the Secateur can switch off the BD's magneton and separate them from each other. In terms of its use in combat, I'm sure you'll figure that out for yourself. <laughs> That's your kind of thing. Affirmative. I'll go look for the beads. Uh, wait! Only with the access codes. Here, take them. They'll open up the gateway into the complex for you. One of the BDs is in the greenhouse sector, here on the surface. You can start with that one. Thanks for the warning. Is this where it all grew from? I have a thought. I'm going to scratch your coat. I'm going to scare you. She's going to catch him. I wonder if this close friend of his is still in the closet. The Chatterbird is well known for being smart and quick with it, but not Sergei. Come back here! You motherfucker! Nachayev! You poor up sly murder! You're a fucking bastard, Nachayev! Professor, come in. Is Ruby. You can call me that on the air. Did you find the carrier? I've got the bead. Heading to the loading room. Over and out. Swamps are amazing places to build a city on, or get rid of a corpse.
I told you everything on that condor. You maggot! You tickled your ass, you smelly cat! Oh, I am sick of this. Professor, the collective malfunction has been corrected. Where's the collective's oversight? Where's Argentum, by all means? Soldiers from the Argentum unit were sent all around the world for the launch of the Atomic Heart Project. They're quite far from here at the moment. That's partly why they couldn't prevent the collective's malfunction. Orchestrated by that traitor Petrov. Oh, wow. Busy fellas. Don't be sarcastic, Major. Uh, Sergei. Yeah, yeah. jamming my signal to the surface. Were you able to negotiate with her? No, Granny won't talk. She's so stubborn. What were you doing? Looking for beads. Polymeric ones. You'll like them. They say you went mad and the beads can help fix you. Who said that?
they run for me like crazy. Don't you it, darling. You are so brave. Crap. And a third. Delightful, honey. It's just us here. So, there were accidents at the facility. Art requires sacrifice, darling.
fourth is in. Beads in the morning, love in the evening. Or is it the other way around? The joining of all people into a united collective represents the rise of mankind to the next stage of evolution. Who's the man? Not again. Looking for that fucking glove? Try and take Over it! Over here, you little fucker! You shit, you're a creep, you surrogate! Nachaya, you four of slime murder! into a united collective represents the rock the Mendeleev statue is there a button underneath it Careful, honey. If you press that, you'll settle problems you're not ready to handle. I'll figure it out, not a child. Oh, my grips! I love the machismo.
little fade. It's bigger than the others, and would look amazing in the Big very star. center of my jewelry. Yeah. Let's get to the shoot. Is ready. Mm, you're tired of sugar. A real macho man. The collective continues to conquer. The collective continues to conquer the world by leaps and bounds. Humans will no longer need to labor. Major Nichaya. and dangerous tasks so, what will, will be, be carried major? out by... Over here, you little... Well, well. 
fucking... Honk, you fucking shit heel! Eat shit. The Collective continues to conquer the world. The Collective continues to conquer Please the world. Please the desired procedure. Quote the Raven. Eat my alien command. Sergei, I'll take some money from you for, ah, uh, bread. I have a saw, and I'm sinking it. Once upon a time, there was a goose who had beautiful golden feathers. Bounds. Humans will no longer need to labor. Such a... You, that, you motherfucker! Come on, you little ass! I won't hold a grudge. Go in peace and fuck yourself. Frick! I say that curse word now? I read somewhere that an empty room is an opportunity. Okay, I put it together. Uh, nope. Whoa! You scared? Sick of this shit. Silly rabbit. Get him punched get tonight. over here! Don't be scared, Sergei. You'll get goosebumps. Right. You're one sick of hell with it, fucker. of myself, but I won't show it. The Collective... Straight to the junk heap. Please select the desired procedure.
There aren't any colorful ones here, just gray. Take your time, darling. We need one of those. But carriers are painted in special colors. This little beauty is also painted a special color. Okay, I'll wait until the common beads join up around the carrier. The electromagnetic radiation will keep the beads from merging. And the second tour doesn't work. How do I even find the carrier? Don't know, honey. Don't give me Dunno. You've got a brain the size of a planet. I don't know. Sixth in place. Bam! And then the result! <laughs> I'm kidding, honey. An aircraft hangar. Interesting.
Cells are too independent. Definitely give it to you. These cute little beaties don't wipe the floor with me.
you, darling. Hurry up and put your gift in my shoes. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. Did you see me there? Cool, right? Ranking number seven. I'm going to get a little more. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Network will transform the world. The Collective 2.0 Network will transform the world. Mankind has taken a step towards the pinnacle of evolution. A single community of people who can control robots with the power of thought knows no bounds. That thing again. I came across it a few times while I was tracking Petrov down. I'm the only one who can see it. Even Charles didn't recognize what it was. A teardrop, darling. You can see it? No, but I can sense when it's around. It's like there's something very important but ghostly coming off of it. I can't understand or remember. Nora, so what is that teardrop? A child of the array, darling. It's a ghost created by someone incredibly powerful. I can't figure out who it is, but I feel that the teardrop is searching for something you threw away. Me? I didn't throw shit away. I've never even had anything. Wait, shit, the rings, the beta connectors. The whole unit was hunting them down, and Charles persuaded me to throw them away. He said they'd only cause trouble. Who knows, honey? You're a military man, so you understand what weapons that kill people. But whose hands they fall into. That's why I threw the rings away. That's why I believe Charles. Forget that nonsense, sweetheart. Now we're together forever, and the past isn't worthy of your attention. Come back from your walk soon, darling. I'll be waiting with bells on.
the last one. All ready for recombination. Ready for what? Promise fulfilled. I promised you a necklace, and you have one. Oh, you're a real man. I'm so happy with you, darling. My darling, you deceived me. You promised you would interpose your will onto me. I changed my mind. Your way of life hurts others. And? Why should I care about others? Why should I have to obey someone else when I have my own free will? And why should someone suffer because your free will is defective? Defective? Says who? You? I'm going to fix you now. As you wish, darling. But keep in mind that I have information about your wife. It won't be saved after recombination. You're making it up. How could you know anything about her? I'm a person. I can certainly make things up, but I learned this information from the teardrop. But you don't care, you hardened bastard. Go ahead, erase my identity. Fine. Tell me what you know. So you can erase me immediately after? <laughs> no, sugar. I don't trust you. Trust me or don't. How are we going to solve this? Deactivate the flying lab completely. The recombination schematic won't be able to launch without it, and then I can rebuild it so no one will know it. How do I disable the orb? You have to turn off the generators. Think something up. You're smart. They're the reason I can't fully block that boring old man's control signals. Cut the power to the generators with a total blackout, and the lab will be deactivated. After that, I'll tell you everything I know. Agreed. Get lost. Nora's got information about Katya. Turns out I'm going to learn something after all. Now you're being taken for a ride by a repair vendor. What could she possibly know about my cutting gun? I'll find out. Idiots are used, not given information. Sitinov killed my Katya. He saved you. He could have saved her too. But the doctor needed her 
upgrade to his vile neuropolymer. The first neuropolymer was created based on living people's brains. You knew about that maggot, but you didn't want to take revenge on your own wife's murderer. That's my business to handle. You can't be trusted, lady. Schmuck! Enough. I don't have time for this. Wonderful bug's life. Yeah, I know. But why? Because I'm tired of everyone lying to me so they can use me for their own purposes. I don't understand what you're claiming, P3. How do you think I'm lying to you? Katarina Nachaipa. She didn't really die in Bulgaria, did she? Who told you that? Agent Blesna died in the line of duty, preventing a nuclear terrorist attack. She couldn't be saved, and your life was only spared because of the Voshod module implant. Oh, of course. And Charles threw me in limbo so he could use my body to kill people as he wished. Setchinov was completely against the use of the Voshod module. But it's thanks to it that you're still alive and haven't gone insane. Look at it another way. Maybe you're the only one who could go into limbo and come back out with no visible consequences. And forget my past brick by brick? I'm getting my memory back, starting with Blesna. Nora's telling the truth. She can't know anything. Nora is manipulating you. So many of you, I stopped counting. I was honest with you, and I refuse to accept your accusations. If you have questions for Dr. Sechenov, ask him directly. He isn't here. I'll try to connect you to Dr. Sechenov with the emergency transmitter. Go to the comms terminal. On the line. P3, my boy. What's going on over there? Too much to explain, and that's the wrong question. What happened to Katya? She's... she's dead. I salvaged her brain. At least... fragments of it. What? Blesna's body was embalmed in neuropolymer. Her consciousness has been transferred to a data carrier, storing everything that made Katya... well, Katya. Crispy critters. Cheridan was telling the truth. It's your twins. I'm afraid... well, it isn't so simple. One day, we'll create the technology to revive Ekaterina, thanks to the robot twins. Why didn't you tell me? For the moment, your wife can't be brought back. But you don't remember her, so why hurt yourself with vague hopes? I want to remember everything. It's physically impossible, Sergei. That part of your brain has been obliterated. All I can do is give you reports of the Nichaya family's past to read. It will not restore your memory, but it may well disrupt the stability of the Voshod module. <sighs> I may not have told you everything, my boy, but I have never deceived you. I need those reports and my leave. I earned them. Very well. I've given you warning, but the choice is yours. You will have as much time as you need. I'll talk to you later then, Dr. Sechenov. We agreed.
Well then, Professor, let's get back to Nora. I promised her I'd disable your lab. If she suspects I've deceived her... She'll change the recombination schematic. I'll cut the power. It'll all be convincing. Hurry up, Sergei. Moving out. She's not a woman, she's a machine, lady. Who cares? She loved you, she trusted you, and you betrayed her, you maggot. Just like you betrayed Katya. Back off, Granny. One day, I'll tear you into bloody rags. You're gonna rot in your grave, you rat. Why are, you, why are you walking in circles, Mateo? You hit your head or something? All right.
Sugar, you leave me no choice. Personal freedom is more precious than your false love. Crispy critters! And the pulse vortex! Are you all right, my boy? Why did you go there alone? You could have waited for help. Wasn't any time. Perform the recombination, my boy. The twins will be busy neutralizing Nora's pulse vortex. They won't be able to help you. But this also means that she can't stop you. On it, comrade Sechenov. Something's wrong. You'll pay for this betrayal. I will kill you. Nora was able to reconfigure the recombination schematic. That's why you couldn't put it together. She didn't have time to cipher the new schematic. I see the new sequence. I'm sending it to you. Rebuild the schematic. That won't happen. You're going to die.
individuality. I want to be able to choose how I live my life. This isn't fair. And killing people is fair? I don't like your individuality. It just causes others to suffer. If only I could be a proud single woman and never mess with a man. Uh-huh. Good ideas always come too late. Don't be upset. It happens to me all the time. My control algorithms have been eliminated. The Nora device is beginning to perform the target objectives. Restoring order to the Mendeleev complex. Lifting complex blockade. Communication with the outside world has been restored. Integration into the United Collective Network has Excellent begun. work, my boy. I knew you wouldn't let me down. You have the deepest gratitude of the entire Collective. I'm glad everything turned out okay. You promised me an indefinite leave, Dr. Sechenov. Of course, my boy. You deserve a rest. Have a pleasant leave, Major. Thank you, Comrade Sechenov. The Kumar is waiting for you in the hangar, Comrade Major. Here is your launch code. Take care of yourself. Your braid is very cute, Katya. I beg your pardon, Comrade Major, but what do you mean? Thanks for the coat. Are you leaving us, Comrade Major? I can open a direct route to the hangar for you. If you would. Safe travels, Comrade Major. I hope the travels actually will be safe. Behave yourself. As you command, my master. <laughs> <laughs> 